here we have a Western Electric slash AT&T 2500 set. Now the 2500 is basically a touchstone version of the original 500 rotary phone. I, I do find it kind of interesting how 2500s have different plate here over the keypad to the body of the phone. Now this originally had a red handset cord but the clip on it had snapped off the plug so I had to replace it with this white one. But it, do, but it still goes with it. Red and white are the first two colors for our, for our American flag. You know, go patriotic. But, any, but anyway, it's a nice phone. Here's the handset. It's a uh, normal Western Electric AT&T G3 handset, but except it, it's, it's branded AT&T. This was, they still refurbished these phones even during the divestiture in the 1980s. And um, they, they still function. It also says on the back, um, Oh, AT and T. It says AT and T there. Sorry about the poor lighting. So here's the uh, keypad. It's a Western Electric keypad, as as always. It's a nice sound. It's a, it has a really nice sound to it. It's alphanumeric. There's the switch hooks. They still do the same thing, like, you know, 500, you know. Um, if you, um, if you were trying to dial it out, you could check for dial tone, and, uh, you can, uh, rest it there. Or, if you answer the call and it's not for you, you can rest it like that. Yeah, so it's just a couple of cool things about it. You can also do that with a um, British Telecom GPO 700 series. So uh, this number card here I made because this phone was manufactured by AT&T. So, manu I mean manufactured by Western Electric, sorry. Um, hopefully. I'll show you the base. Um, here's the original. Original date, um, 1973. There's a purchase date. The refurbished sticker, acted, the refurbished sticker fell off. So this phone was act, this phone was purchased in 1986, a year after it was refurbished. So, so this Western Electric phone was manufactured in 1973. All the exterior parts that you can see are 1985. Cause I took the case off for for inspection purposes, and um, I um, I checked the date code, and they were all they all matched nineteen eighty five. But the inside of the phone is seventy three. So I'll show you dialing out, and then uh, I'll use a I'll use an emulator to ring it back. Here's a dial tone. Oops. <laughs> Why do I always dial the wrong number? The, like I said, the buttons have a cool sound as well. So there you go. And that was dialing out nicely. Now, let me reconnect this from my, uh, I'm, I'm just going to reconnect this to the, uh, emulator. Bear with me one moment. My camera's facing, I don't know why the screen is all black now, but anyway. Here we go. So, without any further lecture, here it goes. Closer. Let me turn this down.
So there you go. <laughs> so anyways, there it goes. Um, this, um, hold on. So there you go. Uh, Western Electric 2500, 1973, R85. So stick around for more videos. Thanks for watching. Light It Up Blue 0419, signing off.